Welcome to Excel with Mark. In this tutorial, I will show you how to find duplicate entries in a table. Here you see a table of order numbers. Let's say you wanted to find out if there were any duplicate order numbers in this table. How would you do it? One way to do this is to sort this data based on order number and then see the duplicate entries. So let's see how to do that. I'm going to select the data and then go to Home, Sort Custom, Sort based on the order number. And let's do A to Z. And there then you can see manually which order numbers are repeating this is not a practical solution as the data set is pretty long. And this is going to be very time consuming let me show you a quicker way. So let me undo the sort which I just did. And I'm just going to add a column now to this data let's add a column called duplicate flag this cell is going to check is there any duplicate values present of this particular order number so let's go. Type in the formula which is counter the range which is from A2 to A29. Let's freeze it by putting a dollar symbol, which is by using the function F4, and then the criteria is going to be the cell C2. Let's press enter. I am going to copy this formula down. There in column H. You see the occurrence of this order number within this list, so we see that the order 53932 occurs twice and the order 53821 occurs only once. Which means there's no duplicate anything that is above one is a duplicate entry. Once we've calculated the duplicates let's just color the rows for which I will duplicate flag greater than 1. So let me just select the cells and go to conditional formatting. I'm going to put a formula. We're going to use the formula based on the fact that column H is constant, but the row is going to change since I'm going to remove the dollar and just say, OK, there you have all the numbers that are duplicates colored red. Now to make it simpler, you could again sort the data based on the order number. Now you are sorting the data based on the order number, and if it's duplicate, it's already in color as you find incorrect entries and get rid of them. Let's say in this case, I see that row 6 is the incorrect entry and I'm going to delete it. The conditional formatting then removes the red color from the order number. This is a very quick and simple way to find duplicate entries in your data. I hope that this tutorial was of use to you. If you liked it, please subscribe to my channel until next time.